Hey, y'all. Uh, we found something the other day. That we like. <laughs> that, yeah, that we definitely like. And we like. wanted to share. <laughs> and uh, I think they've been out for a while, but we just didn't really know that much about it. We saw it advertised in the Zaxby's commercials, the Mr. Beast chocolate feastables. Mm -hmm. and, and we've only tried Here's one this right one. here. Let me not put it in front of your face. But look, but they come in that size. Hold it back up. Yeah, they come, they come in two sizes. This one is a dollar fifty-seven, and that one I think is two fifty-two. So we wanted to get this size because that's a lot of chocolate, but we wanted to get all flavors. We found seven flavors. <laughs> it's gonna be a lot of chocolate to go through, just like the little Debbies. <laughs> So. Yeah, we did try one the other day. We really liked it, and we said, we got to tell people about this because it tastes pretty good. Uh, Let's, what do you want to try first? you want to try almond? We can. That's, that's our favorite. Uh, here's the almond. It's probably like your Hershey's with almond. Remember, we're Hershey people. We went to Hershey's this past, what, last month? Yeah, mm -hmm. beginning of June. And, oh, my goodness, came home, and I was like, I don't want any chocolate unless I go to Hershey's and get it fresh. And then I came upon this, and I was like, oh, my goodness, it's good, and it was fresh. I'm hoping this is fresh. Hey, I broke this one. Oh, oh I'll show them. But how. It comes in this pretty little design, holding it together. Like, this. We, it's broke, but it, that's the way it comes. So, if you're giving it out, you get the big piece, and you give everybody else a little piece, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that it's would melting. Be one. But let's try it out. Okay. But I want a little beauty one because we're going to be trying so much. Oh, there's your piece. And you can see the almonds in it. Pretty good. You ready? Mm hmm. Hmm. That just changes everything. I think I like it without almonds. That's got a lot of, it's got way more almonds than Hershey's. Little tiny pieces. Yeah, the little chunks of chocolate instead of the whole almonds like Hershey has. It's in very their bar. crunchy. The milk chocolate, when we tried it, it was just a savoring, you know, a sa savor the the thing. So, would you like to try the milk chocolate now? Mm -hmm. well, all right, let me tell you about this chocolate, though. It seems to be very smooth and creamy. Yes, it's so creamy. Uh, and from what, what I think I know about chocolate, is they kind of grind the powder up, and the more they grind it up, the smoother the chocolate becomes. It is very smooth. That's what got me. Here's your milk chocolate. But that's real. Oh, oh, she, yeah, you know, she opened the Okay, small speak English. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> open one of the small ones so we didn't have to open that big one. We have two small ones a milk chocolate and a milk crunch. So, but look how little. <laughs> All right, ready? That's still my favorite. It's just like. Smooth, creamy chocolate. Yeah, it's, it's silky mm -hmm. type chocolate. And kind of like Dove chocolate in a way. I think it's actually... The flavor little, is totally different. Yeah, I think it's actually a little sweeter than Hershey's chocolate. Do Something. you think so? Or more buttery. Maybe that's what it is, more know. buttery. I don't know. Sorry, I stuck that other... Sorry, I cheated. <laughs> I stuck the other little piece in my mouth. All right. That's my favorite. Milk chocolate right now is still my favorite. But we hadn't tried peanut butter. All right. I'll give you the double portion. This Which is, one is this? milk crunch. So it's probably like a crackle maybe. Yeah, or a crunch or, bar. It's or little crunch, yeah. tiny, tiny, crunchy things. But it messes up. To me, it messes up the silkiness. The crunchy things. <laughs> <laughs> Very crunchy. You feel it? I still I like that better than the almond. What do you think? That's creamy. That's good. That's better than a crunch bar. I think it's better than a crackle. And I, I'm sorry, Hershey. I love you, Hershey. I bet the milk chocolate's not as good as Reese's. Yeah, it's what the the crisp rice, which is what I think the crunch. That's yours. I think for some reason it's oh, more crunchy thinking, than what's in the Nestle's crunch. Do you I think like so? It. It's creamy. It's more crunchies, but the, it's not as hard. Yeah, but the, yeah, the milk chocolate. Yeah, I'm more keeping thing. these with the wrapper, so we'll know. Uh, I, I picked so. that one, so. Out of milk chocolate, milk crunch, and almond. Which one so far? I think I like the almond. <laughs> yeah. I knew you would. 
Well, we don't have to worry you. about, you can have the milk. I don't know. I really like the milk chocolate, but the milk crunch is good. Cause you know, I'm a, I like crunch bars and crackle. Okay. Well, you want to I try? wonder if the peanut butter crunch is going to be like a good bar. Mr. Good bar. Yeah. I, I think it's going to have peanut butter and so, ground up. Peanuts Should we maybe. go with a peanut butter one or a dark chocolate? We have regular dark chocolate and dark chocolate sea salt. I know oh, you don't want to end up with dark chocolate being your last thing, right? Because it gives you that weird. Actually, I do because <laughs> I, I'm afraid if I eat the dark chocolate first, we have something it will affect the milk chocolate too much because it's so much darker. All right, well, we gonna, which one are we going to do? Peanut butter or peanut butter crunch? Let's go, let's go with peanut butter first. That, that way we can I judge it the... Yet. Uh, addition of the crown. Okay. I'll Take open it. it. You talk. <laughs> All right, let's watch now as Melissa opens no, it. See, you talk. It's melty. Uh oh. It's very, it's, it's, oh my. Well, how did it get melted? It was with the rest? I don't know. It's got peanut it, butter in it. So yeah, oh, that's what it's not really melted. That's the softness to it's it. It's very, so look at the peanut butter. It, is it going to taste better than Reese's? I don't know. Mm. Reese got the sweet, salty thing going on. Oh. All right, let's try it. That is really good. <laughs> okay, the peanut butter in this is just really smooth, creamy peanut butter. It doesn't have any... Mm. Uh, that is good. Oh, it's going to be so hard. That's really smooth peanut butter. It's very sweet, but it's still, it's still not a Reese's. Completely different taste of a Reese's. It's like a Reese's wannabe, but I like it. I thought it was good. How they get oh the my. So smooth. Look at the crutch. I don't know if the camera can pick it up. See the crackles and the peanut butter coming through the crackles? I wish the light was hitting it. There you go. See it? Look at is that it, too. So is it crackles like, like rice in it too? Or? Yeah, it's crunch. Okay. That's what makes it. I see it, it didn't break. It didn't break peanuts. right. That's what I thought. But nope, it's that soft peanut butter with the crunchies. Oh, that's going to be different. You know, there's three of these. I've been cheating, sticking the extra one in my mouth. <laughs> you didn't eat the almond. All right, ready? It's, it's going to be weird. I don't think I've had anything like this. Unless it was a Russell Stover thing. It doesn't have enough peanut butter in it, does it? It doesn't have much peanut butter in, in it as the regular peanut butter. It's good. But you're oh, right, it is the uh, crisp rice in there. But peanut butter was easing through the chocolate. I'm really enjoying doing this because I like chocolate. Yeah, when I, when I brought one of these the other day, I said, let's try one. I said, we don't have to buy the, the big meal. The Zaxby Mills, just to get the little candy bar. He was like, I want to try them all. Let's <laughs> share what we think. Yeah, they're good. All right, you want to, um, you want to start with the regular dark chocolate? Well, I guess, because that the sea salt spray yeah, is the only thing that makes, to me, dark chocolate bearable. And dark chocolate's supposed to be healthy. I wonder what percentage, though. Mm -hmm. You didn't eat your extra. No, but I'm going to. Hmm. <laughs> so. And that's your extra, extra um, almond. I mean, you ain't, ooh, very dark. Yeah. Here, hold it up beside the milk chocolate. Yeah, you can kind of compare very the difference. difference in hold color. it back that way, the way the light oh. will catch it. I mean, I'm going to do it that way. You know I'm going to do it that way. Lean it back. Yeah, look. There you go. See the difference? What is that? Is that an inscription or is that? Just... Yeah, it says uh, Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. Hey, this one doesn't say Mr. Beast. It says Feastables. Oh, the other one says Mr. Beast. Okay, one side okay, says yeah. Mr. Beast. Okay, yeah, the other side of this one says Beast. So. I mean, when we first found it, I was like, we got to look up and see who makes this chocolate. I never did find out. It's just Mr. Beast, and now I'm on his uh, uh, text and email list when they come out with some. They used to have different wrappers. I don't know if they changed them to this for Zaxby's or what. They used to be very colorful. All right, he is, okay. he is not a fan of dark chocolate at all. <laughs> yeah, I was going to give you that disclaimer that I, I'm not a fan of dark chocolate. I wonder if it's going to be as milky. It ain't milk chocolate, but I wonder if it's, it's going to be as creamy and smooth. Uh, Let's try it. Nope. A little hard. <laughs> Very hard, ain't it? It's a thicker. Is it thicker? Boy, it feels thicker. I don't think so, but... It's a lot. A little bit thicker. It is thicker, yeah. Oh, I'm not a fan. Why well, that, well, that way? I'm not a fan. Yeah. I know there are people out there who like dark chocolate. Yeah. 
Yeah, because it's better for This you. is very dark. This is darker than Hershey dark. I don't know what percentage. It has the least amount of fat than all of them. I mean, it only has 10 um, grams. That has 11. I yep. bet that peanut butter has a lot. Yeah, that's very good dark chocolate. 11. But the flavor is still good. I mean, the flavor is good, but that's dark. You're still sticking with almond being your favorite? Mm-hmm. Hmm. hmm. That's yours. Well, that's right. Okay. Last Here's one. Dark last Seasonal. but not least. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to be so hyper. But hey, the grandkids are coming to stay with us for a little bit. We'll be we'll have enough energy, sugar chocolate high, to keep up with them. Ten minutes before their parents pick them <laughs> up, we're giving them all. Giving them a whole bar. <laughs> Wouldn't that be? No, I always mean? get in trouble because I always <laughs> have Mentos in my pocket. But it used to be Smarties. Yeah. Now it's whoa. I don't smart. think this is as thick as the. Regular. It don't dark feel chocolate. as heavy. No, it this doesn't. has seesaw. I wonder if you can see. You can see the little dots. Uh, I can see. I don't know. If, I'm trying to get it with the light. There's little dots. I guess you can see where the chocolate hits. All right. Yeah, it's stormy outside right now, so it's kind of dark yeah, in here. Yeah, and our so. light puts like an orange glow on us, and we didn't want to use it. Well, let's see what the salt does to it. I hope it makes it better. That's usually the only way I can eat. It defeats the purpose, I guess, of eating uh, dark chocolate for your heart because salt's not good if you got high blood pressure. All right, ready? I'm ready. It's crunchy. You cr it's big pieces of salt. Did you crunch some salt? Not yet. Woo! You hear me crunching? I have now. And when you bite that salt, it just releases that salty taste. That is good. That is really good. Not as good as milk chocolate, but it's good. The salt does help the dark chocolate. If, it, have, if it's the same dark chocolate, the salt helps a lot. I have been buying the Lint sea salt uh, chocolate. Is this the dark? Where's the dark? I was going to hold it up. Because this one doesn't feel... Oh, yeah, they're the same. Yeah, they look the same. Just, this one's heavier for some reason. Mm. It does got big granules of salt in yeah, it. Yeah, and once you bite into it... Um, I'm going to eat the extra of that. Oh, you're not eating any extra. Okay, I won't. Oh, I do. Okay, that's all of them. So, you still with almond. Yeah, I'm still okay, with almond. Find your thing. Um, with almond. I was straight up milk chocolate, but uh, I have a new favorite. Milk crunch. It's getting too dark. We may have to cut the... <laughs> yeah, it's getting dark. Uh, it's kind of dark. I can't see it uh, anymore. At least the light's hitting our face, though, so we, mm. we should be okay. Anyway... Milk Crunch is my favorite because you've got milk chocolate that I like. Then the milk chocolate second, but my third is peanut butter. Okay, you gonna keep Straight going? Straight up peanut butter. You are going down the line? No, I'm just doing my top three. Okay. My, my least favorite though, you're not gonna like this at all. Is the almond? It's just got too much almond. What's wrong? Too, there's too many. Too it, you can't enjoy I love the almond. But if you first try this and try milk chocolate. And you get the savory in that. You cannot savor nothing because you're going to choke on an almond. <laughs> Try that almond piece again. Tell me. Try to see. Oh, no. I, I'm, I, okay. Well, do I, your I'm top good. three. Okay. What's your number one? This is number one, right? Number one is the almond. That's number one. Number two would probably be the milk chocolate. And then the peanut butter. That peanut butter was good, wasn't it? And then the peanut butter crunch. Oh, you liked it better than the milk crunch? I think so. I still have the salty in my mouth. That sea that, salt, dark chocolate was good. Yeah. Dark chocolate is my next least favorite. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Did you get well, your top three? Yeah, I gave them top three. What's your bottom? The bottom straight is just up, the straight chocolate. up dark chocolate, but the salt, sea salt and the dark chocolate helped a lot. That was very I mean, good. it really did. And it is stormy looking outside here. It is, it is, it, when it, we walked in, it was sunshiny. And I could hear thunder south of us and thunder north. I was like, we're in the middle. And now that we try to do a video with sunshine, it is dark as night almost out there. I'm trying to get all the extra little bitty pieces. I don't have them open. Right. Ah! Oh, nobody wants that one. The dark, the dark chocolate. Avery. Anyway, I, I guess, uh, all right, closing thoughts. What are you talking about? If you're just tired of regular chocolate, I say go out and try this. But I would go for the small bar. 
just because yeah. it's it's rich unless you want to break it up over you know if it's just you i'd go for the small bar plus it's a dollar and a nickel cheaper i mean this is just a regular but two dollars and 50 something cents for a candy bar that's a little extreme just for the name i guess what yeah. we're paying for but it's still better i mean if you're gonna eat at zaxby's then good get that mr beast feastable meal i thought yeah, it was no 17 dollars it's 12.99 which is not bad once you look at their combos yeah, because yeah, I ate out there last week. It. Yeah, because that I think it's four or five chicken tenders, fries, a drink, the and cheese curds. Well, I've never tried those out there. So, but I say, if you're just looking, if you, if you wanting a little bit more than Hershey or Mars chocolate, try it. Be adventurous. Yeah, or if you just want something different, a different kind of chocolate. Because you will not, is, that milk chocolate a, will not let you down. Even if you just go out and try you're going to have to cut the light on. We're getting fuzzy. Yeah, this is a good We're going to turn orange. Bar. It's a trick. Ready? Ta -da, we're going to be orange. Uh, <laughs> ah! <laughs> well, I really did turn it. We have the, well, it's whatever came with our ceiling fan, soft light. Yeah. I'm yellow now. And Come on over here. What color are you? You're a little pink. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, you can see the light. Reflecting oh, off the mirror behind us too, yeah. You can see our collectibles so, uh, up there too. I, I say go for it. We found them at Walmart. Um, that's not, and that they're at convenience stores, but we knew Walmart would probably be cheaper. Yeah. But these, the little ones, are are not with candy. They were on as seen on TV, but I have not seen these on TV other than the Zaxby's meal. Yeah, and the big ones were on like the regular. regular and you can get out. like a pack. How much was that six pack of those? I think it was like seven dollars. Well, or that's something good like that. if they're two fifty a piece. Yeah. Or was it this size? It was this size bars, wasn't it? Yeah, I think it was. Okay. Oh well, but we love chocolate, and that trip to Hershey's was just a. It was a dream. I mean, I loved it. The every bit of the chocolate that I had there, and the chocolate we brought home has been eight. I don't. I think even what we gave away. Yeah, and it was just actually fun being there. Oh, I want to go again. Where they gave you chocolate uh, at the uh, little tour that you took, and we, also we rode that thing two or three times, maybe. <laughs> yeah, we had the restaurant, the chocolateer, and when they brought us her uh, check, they brought us candy again. Yeah, there they gave away it. a lot of chocolate, and uh, it was just, it was just fun. And we've got a video on Hershey, Pennsylvania. Uh, if you want to check that out, but it, uh, you need to visit there at least once if you're able to. I mean, yeah, I've been wanting, it was fun. wanting to for years and years. I didn't think we would ever get there because we usually go to the beach or to the mountains. And we finally came over from the beach on our last trip and uh, we stayed at one of their cabins and it was just fun. It was a great experience. I would love to go there when it was a little cooler. <laughs> so the chocolate won't melt. <laughs> we had to take that yeah. chocolate everywhere with us. Yeah, we did. We, we bought some chocolate whenever we... Every time we went in we Chocolate World, it. we bought chocolate. Yeah. But uh, getting back to poor old Mr. Beast, he's some guy, and this is his chocolate bars, and I don't know anything about him. I'm not promoting him or anything. We just wanted yeah. to taste the chocolate. So. Yeah. Because I <laughs> watched me find out he's some crazy guy or something. Who knows? <laughs> but he makes good chocolate bars. <laughs> <laughs> or somebody makes it for somebody him. Somebody makes yeah, it yeah. for him. But that, that peanut butter blew me away. Yeah, it was really good. It was really... I, I, it was like one of those big, huge Reese things that you get with it. so much peanut butter in the bar. Like, like Taylor, had you? Yeah, it's it it's not like peanut butter like you would take out of a jar or out of a Reese because yeah. there's, you can't feel any of the peanuts ground up in there. I mean, it's just completely smooth. So, are you eating chocolate? <laughs> sea salt. That's your dark chocolate. I took the sea salt. Okay. I, I'll, I'll leave it. Well, thanks so much for watching us. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you enjoy hanging out with us. Sorry, I'm talking with my mouth while you finish. And subscribe. And, and the bell. Yeah, and, and I always forget to say the bell. If you turn on those notifications and if you don't want to miss anything from us, it will let you know every time we post, whether it be a comment, a photo, a video, a short, it will let you know. Mm -hmm. So, you got anything else to say? No, that's it. Are you hyper? <laughs> probably my brain is just like <laughs> but it's good. not only did we get sugar we got caffeine and now we have have chocolate for days, days. <laughs> and now then we're gonna be 
Yeah. Our grandkids will probably get a little, maybe. Yeah. Our kids, too, because as our, one of our daughter-in-law calls us, we're foodies, because when we find out Hershey's and we tried it, we were just sending pictures and saying, what kind you want? We'll bring it home. Mm. And she called yeah, us we foodies. Yeah. <laughs> we, if we find a new drink or a new chocolate or a new anything... We call it, have you tried it yet? You want me to get you one? You know, that kind of stuff. Because we love, me and my daughter love when Coke and Dr. Pepper releases a new flavor. I'm sorry I didn't do a video on the new Sprite or the new Dr. Pepper coconut. But I wasn't really a fan. And I just didn't really want to promote it. So, but did you like it? Nope. <laughs> now, the, 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 the Sprite with the cherry, that's just like a, what do you call it? Yeah. You, what yeah, is that? You, you, Shirley Temple. It, yeah. It'd be good in the summer. I don't see it anymore. I don't know if they've pulled it. I really still love the strawberry Dr. Pepper, but the coconut, I thought I would love it. Maybe if I had tried it at the beach, it would have been better, but it just didn't hit the spot for me. And I haven't seen, the kids hadn't been asking for it. No, yeah. it anymore. It was hard to get rid of my 12 pack. No, but even year, many, many years ago, I worked at Dairy Queen when I was a teenager and people come in and got uh, cherry sprites back then. Shirley so Temple. That, yeah. So, uh, you know, that's a pretty common thing. But there's what is sweet is what you would make yeah, up there. You know, the cherry true. wasn't a, a lot. But, I mean, it was okay. It, I liked it better than Dr. Pepper, and that's saying a lot with being Sprite. So, I'm a Dr. Pepper pub extra girl. So, anyways, yeah. hope you're having a good day, weekend, yeah. whatever it is for you when you watch this. We hope it's great. And let's live life. Together. Always. Bye. Bye. Go try you some chocolate. <laughs>